This playthrough is rated E for everyone. Is it me, or is this not normal day getting even more not normaler? Whoever's got that magic page, they're starting to get creative. Let's stop them before they add a new chapter to this awful novel. Page over yonder! Some say squid ink has many uses, including eye makeup and possibly engine lubricant. I'm ready to be a superhero, but be careful, it won't last long. Greetings and salutation viewers, Voldemort back here with another episode of Spongebob Hero Pants. I can actually do a recap. In the last episode, we finished off uh, uh, be, uh, initially Bikini Bottoms areas as we uh, ended up gathering all the pages there, but we also had a, a tackle an evil robot at Plankton's that had gone berserk, AWOL as it were, but we took him out and, uh, well, we gotta continue onward to get the rest of those pages because some photorealistic dolphin told us to. And if a photorealistic dolphin tells you to do something, you do it. That's why they call them the kings of the sea, am I right? Am I right? What do you mean I'm not right? What do you mean it's like, it's either the shark or the whale? Who cares about whales? Oh, the whale organization doesn't want me to talk bad about them? Oh, I see. Well, all right. Uh, whales are awesome, anyway. So, we're continuing on. Uh, we're no longer in Bikini Bottom, we're just under the sea, and now we're just in a new place under the sea. Looks like we got some... Well, okay, so... The color scheme of the print monsters in the previous level have been changed! Ooh! Alright, now we got... Zombie burgers? Zombie crab burgers? Have they gone AWOL and just been against Mr. Krabs' ways and... and stuff? I, I don't know. Alright, uh, I don't see any collectibles. So. Oh, I missed a coin, I noticed. Now, do I really need to... Eh, no, I don't. Besides, I'm almost maxed out Spongebob anyway, so I'll... Did, was I able to jump up there without using the lightning bolt? Like, even though that's what I was supposed to do? My skills are impre <laughs> impressive, young Skywalker. Most impressive. Okay, well, anyway, so <laughs> yeah, apparently I can... Well, I, well, I was complaining that there wasn't... Oh! Now we don't... Now we don't have, uh... Now we have sea urchins to deal with, like, uh... Sea urchins are, at least in the show, they were they were shown as being more like ticks or, or fleas than uh, than what they actually are. And now we got uh, are those what are those aren't are those just different types of spatulas? I guess they are. I don't. Looks like there's a four player. Oh, oh no, oh no. I I I I think I see. I was about to say there can't be a four player slot or uh, puzzle, is there? But, uh, it'll be interesting to find out what. I am kind of curious to find out what caused all this. Is it like that in the show? Like, did the sh the show or the movie based on that explain it? I haven't seen it, so I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine, folks. Okay, so can I actually get? I probably could actually with superpowers. Oh yeah! Don't even have to try. I gotta admit, almost almost using the superpowers is almost like activating a cheat code or something. You know what I mean? I mean, is that is it just me that thinks that? So? All right, I'm gonna grab that other coin because sometimes my OCD is on, sometimes it isn't. Okay, let's uh let's do this. Uh, Simon says I didn't even it went by too fast. I think. Oh, did I? See, it went by so quickly, I didn't even get to see it. Okay, now I know which one. So like, when I first stepped on it, I swear two colors lit up at the exact same time. I was like, hey. No. Come back here. I was, oh, okay. I was about to say, I'm not even on top of it. Yeah, man. When was the last time you saw a Simon Says game in anything? I know that's not what they probably call it, but that's what that's what it is. Is that still around? I guess it is. I mean, it's one of those name brand things that maybe not doesn't sell like hotcakes, but uh, it's got it's got name recognition that uh, that my even my even my generation is aware of Simon Says. Maybe not as well, but I love robots. But I know it. I was never very good. Well, I wouldn't say I was I was terrible at it, but I wasn't great at it either. Like I would uh, 
I could do it for a bit of time, but then I would kind of get locked up after, you know, so many rotations. Short-term memory is kind of like, uh, I'm not bad with it, but, uh, I'm definitely not, uh, my, my mind is not as clear or as, uh, ready to pull information as it used to be, now that I'm a lot older. And your brain gets slower the, the, as the years go by, or if you don't, uh, strain your brain and force yourself to think. And most adults don't have to do that as often, unless you're in a job that requires that, like, uh, science or engineering or something like that. Or unless you, I mean, probably a good thing is to probably keep uh, your brain active by purposely trying to keep yourself, even if you're not trying to do it for a job, just going someplace and trying to, you know, just trying to learn new things just because, and no other reason other than to keep your, uh, uh, keep your brain active so it doesn't start slowing down. Okay, so we can either, right, I guess I need to fall down. I missed a coin. I found the like one from before. Oh, there's another. Oh, I found all the. Oh, it just it was just one switch for the clip. Okay. Nice. All right. Okay. Oh, there's a. I almost missed that. Man, they're starting to hide those pages. You know what I mean? Man, too many uh, areas that don't require SpongeBob specifically. For being the head of the, uh, for being the head of the series, you know, there's not a whole lot of uh, doors that use his have bubble ability. Don't worry. As soon as I upgrade, as soon as Bun SpongeBob's abilities get completely maxed out, I'll swap him over to another character. That'll be when I do my uh, when I do my uh, pause in between recording sessions. I'm still in recording for the last one. Normally, I would stop recording after a major area change like this like after fighting a boss, but, uh, well, I had, I had some extra time. Okay, am I missing something? Maybe there's another switch somewhere I, I missed? Uh, I don't... I don't see anything. Maybe... Maybe I just need to jump over. Oh, pst, derp. I was about to say, it can't be, like, this game can't be that complicated, right? It doesn't require backtracking. And it doesn't. I mean, that would have been a nice surprise, actually. I'm like, this game actually requires me going back through other areas just to continue on with the game? I mean, yeah, most people hate backtracking, but at least it would show that they want to do more of this game than just be a simple platform. But I can't knock on it too hard for what it's what it's supposed to be. You know? It's not trying to be like an RPG. It's not trying to be like an action game like Devil May Cry. It's not supposed to be a stealth drama like uh, Metal Gear Solid. So you know you can't uh, you can't really like blame it. It's just trying to be a platformer. I remember ah oh, I didn't mean to do that. Dang it! Mm. I won't get the achievement for Invinsa. Whatever. Oh well. I have a bad habit of wanting to press X to double jump, even though that has nothing to do with the jump options in the game. Oh, well, it's not like I need that achievement. I was just, I was just doing it just to try. Alright. Man, we should be able to... This, uh, by, actually, the end of this level might be where we end up uh, completely upgrading Spongebob. So then we can swap out. Although, funny enough, I, I, as soon as I end up swapping out Spongebob, we end up all the secret page areas that require him to be played as or something. Okay. Come on down, jellyfish. King jellyfish. Or is it queen, was it queen jellyfish in that one episode? Actually, I think it was queen jellyfish. And it had the voice of, like, a, a gnarled old lady. Ugh. You know, like one who had too many, uh... Had, uh, for, uh... Grown too much in their early ages or something. But say I was just gonna do that just to get it out of the way. Uh, no, I've already got the one collectible, so I don't have to worry about those. Or oh, those? Do those hurt you? I don't. If it did, it, it didn't do much to me. It doesn't look. Or maybe it's my superhero form makes me uh, uh, harder to harder to hurt or something. I mean that would make sense, I guess, right? Because you use this ability to. Uh... Well, no, then that's I was hurt during the. Uh, not very much, but I, I did take a couple hits during the uh, Plankton uh, robot fight, so. 
Looks like we got another co-op area I can't do. No, so, it's, so it's a case of pressing all those just to... Oh well. Yeah, pressing... I, I don't know if it stays up. Whoops. Didn't notice the little hole there. Good thing I'm not in control of uh, SpongeBob's destiny, otherwise he would have he would have fallen to the way of uh, the uh, sea urchins long ago, or whatever they call the loss of uh, loss of functionality in the world of SpongeBob. Yeah, so I'd say we might as well just turn into a superhero and finish him off quickly. Is it just me, or the level's a little bit longer, or am I just? Or have I just been rambling on about random stuff for so long that I that just feels No, that would make the level shorter, but then if you ramble on I don't feel oh it's almost over. It's like no, I almost feel like they're a little bit longer. Although that's usually the main progression of a lot of games is that the first couple of levels will be a little short, uh, and then by the end they'll get decently long, but uh Looks like it's another it's a smash and grab area, so. And I have noticed that when you turn it as a superhero, you get a lot more powerful, so. So, uh, it's worth it tur turning into them just so you don't have to worry about, uh, so you can kill stuff quicker, you know? They once had to eat these? What? Are they making fun of our hamburgers? Then again, very few people know how to make a very good hamburger these days. And if you say that if you say that McDonald's is the prime example of good hamburgers, then you need to be you need to be taken out and whipped. That's right, I said that. But anyway. Or did he say they were archaic patties because they're made out of stone? Maybe that's what he meant by being a eh. I could have avoided that, but really there's not much There's not much penalty for that really. Whoa. That uh, kind of surprise. Oh, we're at the end of the world already. Come on, jump up. There we go. All right. Now let's see if uh, see if we have enough money to to max out. Sp okay, I did go do do that little lot faster, like two minutes quicker than I usually do. Huh. All right. Well, let's uh, upgrade. Ah, no, we gotta do one more level of SpongeBob. Uh, I mean, nothing wrong with that. Just it, it'll be a nice change of pace to be able to play someone else for a bit. So, all right. So after beating, you know, the uh, uh, Plankton bot, we're in a whole new area, collecting more pages and coins with new enemies that have been reskinned to different colors because that's original character design. But find out next time to see what SpongeBob and Co get into. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.